Hi, this is Jordan with Cal Bassin. Uh, today I'd just like to bring uh, to you guys a rod and reel or my arsenal video. Um, so let's get right into it. So right here is my main weapon of choice. It's a St. Croix Mojo Bass. Right now I got a 50 pound braid on it because down here at the California Delta there's a lot of uh, weeds, mats, tulies, stuff like that. Uh, I need to punch through. Got an ounce weight uh, with uh, paycheck baits, um, a flipping skirt, and the paycheck baits uh, hook with the uh, with the moldable hook uh, bait keeper uh, so yeah the rod is a seven foot medium heavy perfect for me fast action uh, the tip on this is really good nice and fast also very flexible and strong uh, you know, St. Croix has a very good uh, selection of rods. My favorite so far. Uh, it's caught me many, many fish. Uh, they use the new SC2 graphite material, uh, which makes it uh, very strong and lightweight. Uh, it's very sensitive and durable. That's the main thing. You know, I accidentally, it's a funny story, I accidentally uh, dropped the whole rod and reel into the reservoir that I fish at. And I actually had to jump in and go get it, and it still works perfectly fine. Real smooth as hell. Uh, no damage on the cork or the paint or the rod or anything. Perfect little setup right here. I use this mostly for pitching, flipping. Uh, this is my more uh, versatile rod that I have. And uh, speaking of reels, I have the Lose Speed Spool. The uh, Lose Speed Spool. This is uh, the hundred dollar version. Got it off a of Tackle Warehouse. Go check them out. I got both of these at Tackle Warehouse. I actually ordered it on Friday and uh great customer service they got back to me and they actually got it the next day and they usually don't um they usually don't uh ship on weekends but yeah this is a 7.1 to 1 gear ratio really fast to get it back you know uh get that slack back up in the line get that slack back up uh great for when the fish bite it and uh, you could just crank one just one turn of the reel and the slack's gone easy to set the hook alright yeah so loose speed spool nice perfect reel got the 1 through 10 magnetic brakes and also the knob right here and then the star So yeah, then moving on to my more cheaper rod, I haven't, yeah, so this is the Abu Garcia Vengeance, uh, 6 foot 6, medium, heavy rod, uh, paired up with the Abu Garcia Black Max Reel, this is a perfect setup, very balanced, uh, this 24 ton graphite, make, very light, fits perfectly in my hand you know I could cast most baits with just one hand on this and then I got it paired up with 15 pound mono just for little spinner baits and uh, stuff like that great rod and reel the tip very flexible yet strong I don't know what people are talking about when they say that this breaks a lot because I have caught many three three to four pound fish and they fought 
they fought very, very strongly, and uh, nothing's happened yet. Crossing my fingers. Yep. The Black Max Reel, this is, I think, a 6.4 to 1 gear ratio. Pretty slow, but still, it's not really used to burn burning things. I just use it for crankbaits. I like I like the a little bit faster than 5.4 to 1 because I could either burn it really fast if I want it to or I could just slow it down even more to get that nice wobble. This doesn't have the 1 through 10 magnetic brakes, but it has the star and the tension knob. Really smooth reel too, really smooth. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching. Uh, get back. Please uh, comment down below. Tell me uh, how I did on this video. Uh, if you want any suggestions, anything, uh, any uh questions you have about my rod and reels and stuff like that please get back to me so yeah thank you